yeah, I, I um, first joined um, ILCC through AmeriCorps, and um, I learned about it through my supervisor, Rich Kong. Um, I, being an undergrad at North Park, I served a lot in the Urban Outreach Department, and um, Rich was the director at the time, and um, so I was involved a lot. Um, I led a homeless ministry in undergrad, and so I built this connection with Rich. And Rich, he built me um, my final weeks as a senior in college. And he's like, hey, he's still looking for a job, and there's a position through Illinois Campus Compact through AmeriCorps, and um, you would be working at North Park, um, working on getting students involved into the community to do service work. I think North Park really prides themselves in um, like service and being intentional and, and kind of finding your next path. And I felt like, um, you know, the work that I did as an undergrad, um, working with those experiencing homelessness on Lower Wacker, propelled me to see uh, a different um, a different Chicago that many people don't see and um, that there's a lot of um, issues taking place in our city, systemic issues, and I feel like as in higher education there's a great opportunity for college students to um, be educated and to engage in difficult conversations um, across race, culture, um, all this class and all that stuff. And I, seeing that, helping me see that as an undergrad and North Park exposing um, that opportunity for me um, allowed me to want that for students coming in after my time. And I felt like there's a great platform there to engage the community. I felt like North Park has really served me well in that capacity. It's a uh, experiential learning program that allows students to um, engage the city while taking courses, focus on the city as well. Um, part of the program requires students to serve at an organization for six to seven hours per week, and it allows them to um, work with an organization, learn how to nonprofit runs. Um, if they're a business major, they, they do a lot of work with like marketing or, um, or accounting or, or uh, recruiting, things like that. Um, if they're like, uh, let's say they're a global studies major, we would send a student working with, um, you know, working with refugees and helping them settle in Chicago for the first time. And so, depending on like the student's interest and gifts and major, um, we we try and work with them where they can really be uh, an asset and um, helping the community in the area of, of their expertise and their interest. I actually. Uh, backtracking, I helped write the proposal as an undergrad, so uh, I saw this program in like its embryonic stage, like very small, um, and so now it's like we're two years into the program, which is amazing, but um, I, uh, as a VISTA, I, um, I helped place students at their practicum site, so I formed relationships and uh, partners with community organizations around the city and develop uh, partnerships where you know students would then serve. Um, I would also run logistics on Wednesday afternoon sessions. Um, we call them catalyst sessions and those are essentially where students go engage different neighborhoods. We do different museum visits. Um, we uh, visit different organizations in the city. So facilitating those days, making sure like everything runs smoothly making it a, a really impactful learning experience for them. So Catalyst is expanding as a whole. It's a new department at North Park. So we have Catalyst courses, we have Catalyst semester, which I just explained, um, and then we have Catalyst on campus. So we have these three main programs um, centered around Catalyst 606. Um, and so we are a small staff of Rich, this is my supervisor, myself, and then two AmeriCorps Vistas through ILCC, and so it's just four of us, it's small, um, but we're kind of handling each program. So Kate Gonzalez, she's um, uh, AmeriCorps Vista member since uh, March, she's taking on Catalyst courses. Um, so she's working with faculty and, uh, and allowing them to 
engage the city uh, through different experiences through their uh, course curriculum. And uh, I'm taking on Catalyst uh, semester, so my role with that is expanding a lot where I'm, I'm doing a lot more managing, I'm connecting with a lot more students. Um, I'm actually like setting up a lot more of the uh, the tours and the Wednesday sessions and blocking those in. Um, we have more students, so we're also expanding cattle semester where we've grown every semester. So I'm, I'm uh, also uh, you know, placing more students at their practicum. So um, I think a lot of it, and then cattle's on campus, which is um, where we bring the city to campus and there's different um, activities held focused on the city and different departments are running different events on campus so that happens every Wednesday afternoon so we're really trying to create a place where students can um, where the city of Chicago is like just here on campus and that they can also engage outwards I would say you know for any new Vista starting um, to really have an open mind and really um, you know, utilize your gifts and your strengths and your interests and really exercise that. But also, when I mean open mind, uh, you know, allowing yourself to engage with different material that you haven't, you haven't done before. Um, I think it stretches you and it helps you grow, especially as a young professional. Um, you know, as for me, I, I didn't know marketing was going to be really part of my job, but then I have developed a lot of promo materials for Catalyst. I've developed uh, posters, and um, and so and now I kind of have an enjoyable liking to it that I thought I didn't. So just having an open mindset and um, allowing the student, or not the student, but the the new uh, Vista to to you know use their craft um, in an effective way, but also being open-minded.